go to bed at night and you think about the best case scenario for this technology and this trajectory we're on, which is accelerating and you're enabling, what could the world look like in 10 years? We, let's say, it's pretty obvious we're hitting artificial general intelligence at this moment. I think we'd all agree we're starting to see that. But super intelligence can't be far behind that. I assume you agree with that. Um, assume we hit that super intelligence. What would the world look like in 10 years in the most optimistic scenario if we do this right? Well, I think the exciting part about it, and you know, I can say this ex very sincerely, I mean, this is the most um, transformational technology sort of in our lifetimes. I mean, that's the way we should think about it. Orders AI. of magnitude. Orders of magnitude. And the reason is it's not just going after one aspect, right? You can actually take AI and make science better. You can take AI and make medicine better. You can take AI and make manufacturing better. You can take AI and make every aspect of your business better. And so, you know, in my mind, 10 years from now, we'd like to believe that we are um, you know, really leveraging it to solve some of the world's most important problems. I, I like to say, like, you know, AMDers get up in the morning and they say, you know, how can I use technology to solve some of the most important challenges um, in the world? And, you know, AI is really our mechanism you know, for a, doing that. 